Reese, who've never danced hip hop or contemporary before, ever. Absolutely top for me tonight. Fabulous. I'd like some, some maybe hip hop or dance hall. Yeah. Yeah. Hip hop! Freak out, Charlie. Don't freak out. Hi. 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 So today we're going to kind of do a dance hall piece. Yes. Are you familiar with dance hall? I don't know what Okay, it's got a Jamaican feel to it. Dance hall, it's got elements of Afro and Cuban in there. And what we're doing is more of a modern style that you see in hip hop video clips. I'll show you some foundation steps of dance hall. Butterfly. In. Out. Willy bounce. Step. Bounce, step on line, round. It's fantastic. It's a style that I've always wanted to learn. Like, I've kind of tried to emulate it a little bit when I'm on the dance floor, but to actually discover the technical aspect about it is really great for me. The most difficult part is probably the bit where Gemma is bending over me. We're both in back bends. It goes against every kind of stretching posture that I've ever been taught. Yeah. It's easy on your own, but when you've got somebody else on top of you, it makes it twice as difficult. Okay, okay. the challenge would be pelvic movements. You're not moving your upper body. It's a lot to do with your knees and all of this part, so you're going to hit. Even though we're just working with the pelvic area, I need to see it from all parts of them. So that would be the challenge today for Gemma. Okay. You need to have it down, your knees need to be out, and you need to push side, 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 side. I have to somehow move my hips, so that's going to make it quite difficult. <laughs> Flick and wind. <laughs> Usually I'm very, very shy and quiet, but this time I have to be out there, sexy, raunchy, just, oh, I just want people to want me kind of thing. So it'll be quite a challenge for me. Not around, then go around to the side. Somehow I always manage to get a style that I have to be an animal. So, <laughs> again, <laughs> bring the tiger out. <laughs> Can they find their inner tiger? Ladies and gentlemen, they're ghetto fabulous, Gemma and Reese. Breaking it up and setting it up in the big way, making the girls them chill their mind, making them have a good time. Yeah, man. SPZ, yo, long side we re Come down now, Rihanna, take it to them, take it to them, girl. so far. This is the best crowd we've had so far. You guys are rock. All right, let's check what the judges thought, Matt. Wow, is it getting hot in here or what? <laughs> wow, there's like a thousand Mary Murphys in the room. Okay, so... <laughs> First, let me say, Gemma, you are stepping up, baby. You are getting better and better and better. 
It was raunchy, it was sexy. Tiana said she wanted you to bend and really get down. I think you both really took on her notes and really got down and really got into it. The only criticism I have is that I would like more energy. I know you were out there busting it, but it just lacked that little extra 50%. Bonnie is sitting next to you right now, just flabbergasted. Look, slap, it. <laughs> slap me. I'll slap you if I find you. More energy. More energy, Bonnie? Oh, there was plenty of energy there for me. Definitely yeah. plenty of energy. <laughs> And that beginning, that very first opening, was not only hot, it was sizzling. It really was. Uh, I truly think, um, and that's just said it, you both grow and grow each week. Gemma, you're a chameleon. You take on anything, everything, put it together. It's just great. I've got to ask, you know, I always have to ask these questions, and I'll ask you, Reese. How was it working with the pair of you kind of that close? <laughs> You mean with Gemma from the block? Uh, <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, okay. Nah, <laughs> nah I think um, we've, we've already got such an amazing close bond. It's, you know, you, you said candlelight dinners. I think it's more like X-rated theatre that yeah. we needed tonight. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, funny enough, I was going to talk about that candlelit dinner. I thought you must have had um, lunch as well. <laughs> I stayed for breakfast, honey. <laughs> Great though, great routine, absolutely fab and very saucy. <laughs> Jason? Yeah, saucy certainly describes the start. I'm still blushing from that opening <laughs> position. Uh, my godson's here tonight. I hope you're not looking. Oh. Um, great job. Really, really, really great job, both of you. And you keep doing this, the two of you. You keep grabbing your routines and doing really, really good jobs of them. So congratulations to both of you on that. The first pass down after that opening position, I really liked how funky that was. You really opened up with a really great feel when you came down and dropped into the split. That first pass was really nice. Uh, Reese, really, really blokey. I really bought that from you. I thought you were really masculine there. I did. That's really great, fella, because you're, you're a chameleon, you know? You, you, you are whatever you decide to be. And it's not enough to just be a dancer. You have to be an actor as well. You have to, you know, adopt whatever role that you're playing, and you certainly did that. Gemma, your diversity is just going like this, 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 this. It's just going up, 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 and up. That's a really great way to start this evening. Congratulations to both of you. If you want to vote for Reese or Gemma, SMS their names to 191010 or call 1902 555561. If these two are your favourites, then it's easy. You just really you just have to pick up the phone and vote. Lines open at the end of the show. Sizzling, sizzling opening number. We loved it. Still to come though, we have rumba, samba, and jazz. Plus, Demi and Jack are.